Hey folks, this is James, the unofficial mayor of Cowboy Country. We are here in beautiful Athens, Georgia, home of the Georgia Bulldogs. And I have to say that um, this side over here, at least, is very modern looking. That's really good. I, I love the, the gray, but you got the red tint. I mean, can I see how the, the windows, there's, it's a little bit of red tint. It's not like overbearing, but they're, they're trying to incorporate their school colors. And yes, they are doing a little bit of construction right now. I see dog, well, I don't know what a dog bite is. I see a sign over there that says dog bites. Maybe they're like the beaver nuggets or uh, at uh, Bucky's. I don't know. But you got, I mean, this is really good looking. It's just, we're on the non. I, I don't know if I. I kind of went down here and had to turn around to park. I do see a, a, a concession sign, so concessions are important, so let's find out what they have. I can't see with my eyes, so let's kind of peek through. I can't see. Let's see here. Ooh, mac and cheese, pretzels, hot dog, barbecue pork sandwiches, that's really good. Peanuts, peanuts. Barbecue sandwich is good. Good job. Here, let's pull this back through the fence. Yes. You must have barbecue. Good job, Georgia. This is very modern looking. Let me, let me back it up a little. Uh, maybe this is like new. I'm not sure. I can't tell. Reed and Cynthia. Stopped at a, a gas station earlier. They didn't have a freaking. Well, they had a bathroom, but it was out of order. I see an open gate. Shh, be very, very quiet. We're hunting rabbits. The press box. Period. Do not touch. Oh, well, look at the. Oh, I do not like heights. This is this is really good. I love the hedges. I'm gonna see if I can go get over there. So. Concourse area looks really good. I wonder if the men's rooms are open. Is I really gonna go? Anyway. I'll be right back. So I've got to move my car to go around to that other walkway. But I can tell you, I I already I saw a different concession stand that had Papa John's pizza. So concessions are really good here. This is really good. My only concern so far is parking. 
haven't seen a whole lot of I'm assuming they got they have to have at least one parking garage excuse me nearby sorry I ran out of allergy medicine earlier this week so I need to get some before I get back to Texas and have to deal with all the nasty cedar so I'm gonna get in my car I'm gonna go back around to the other side I'm gonna try to do the the side that's visible from the road because it looks pretty good and then wait a minute let me let me try to get from here let me flip this around okay so we got this is gate seven see like I get the whole concrete look thing you know with a larger stadium Another thing, I guess I I, I can imitate Rady's rides, <laughs> but uh, give them a zonk is on the gates. They should have like a, a the the Georgia logo somewhere built into the gate. But at least they got plenty of concessions over here, you know, for their fans that are in the end zone. You know so all right so back to the car and then we'll get we'll go over on the other side I, I've never seen anything like this before you've got this section here where it says University of Georgia I hate heights I'm gonna have to cross this I don't want to cross that bridge, but they got flags there that tell, said 1942 and have some other years. I need to go down further and find out where that uh, place is where you can walk across and see some of the inside of the stadium. Now, this is interesting. You have this Reed Hall millage hall and i don't know what the name of that building is but they're literally like right next to the stadium so what i want to do is take you down here and get the rest of this side i think i have to go over to that light and turn to get to the plaza but there was some stuff that i saw when i drove by that was cool enough it was good enough to where it's like you know what we need to include this in the video because if you look, like that sign over there that says Safer Stadium, that's pretty cool. Let me back it up a little. You know, you got a, a, some parking here. I'm assuming that if you can park here during game time game times uh, you're probably spending a good chunk of money <laughs> I think the stairways are interesting they I, I like the fact that they're you know sturdy and metal and but they went with black so it's kind of a neutral color Considering with the with all the gray that's on the stadium, I kind of I like it. It, it. it actually goes with, you know. But I wanted to come over here because you got. Um, Patrick and Kara Jones family gate. Oh, I like that. See, you got some bathrooms even on the outside unless this is a, a gate I don't know if I'm supposed to be over here this is cool so okay all right this is much better I'll, I'll get to that in a second but look you see how like I was saying on some of the other gates, they didn't have the logo built in. 
well they got it here that's cool that is that is that is really cool simple but that's your logo so run with it I love the fact that they've got concessions and bathrooms available on the outside grab and go that's cool I mean, if you got long lines at your concession stands, you can actually put a little bit of your concessions on the outside of the stadium before people go inside. Okay. Well, let's, let me get this, of course. That's really cool. Now, I'm suspecting that when they first did this, that that may have been like a... They may have painted it red, I don't know. If they didn't, they should. The inside part. You know. I do like the, the black brick and you know, how the Georgia logo is, is built in. But if you're gonna do that, then well I guess you know in 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 the, that logo, see. See how it's white? inside of the G so I guess if you're gonna do that here then the inside of the G would also have to be white so okay that makes sense I do think it's cool that these student houses student housing is literally right next to the stadium that is super cool and benches Gotta like that. I do like how all of the concession stands are red. I mean, there's not a whole lot of color on the stadium itself, but all of the major beams and stuff are covered in concrete, so it's very solid. Reed Plaza, this is nice. Oh, what do we got here? A little bit of history, all right. The five, okay. See, this is the kind of stuff you show your kids and your grandkids so they learn the history of your school. Five African-American freshman football play for Vince Dooley. They broke the color barrier. Richard Appleby, Horace King, Clarence Pope, Ch joined Chuck Kinnebrew and Larry West. Okay, that is super cool that they honor these guys. Okay, so you got Horace King, Clarence Pope, Jack uh, Larry West, and Richard Apple. Sweet, okay. Okay, that's that walkway over there. I gotta work my way around. But I wanted to come back this away because I, did, I just noticed these signs. SEC Champs 1966, okay. 1968. See, this is the kind of stuff I really like because it shows the history of your school. That's that's super cool. 1976. All right. Did a bit before my time, considering I was born in '73. Look at those old school helmets. Nineteen eighty. I do remember eighty. I remember Herschel Walker, one of the best running backs of all time, no doubt about it. Great athlete. Drum major. Of course, if she was a college student in 81, she's probably in her 60s right today. SEC champs. 82. 2002. Hey, there you go. John... Stinchcomb. 
you gotta you gotta showcase the the big boys. You can't just there's an open gate. Well, I already got an inside shot. I don't need to do that again. Okay. I'm gonna go back to the car and try to find um, get where that where that open area is at that one end zone. So must be the construction that they're doing. Not really sure what what it is. I'll have to look it up. Here, but the sign says what it is. Stanford Stadium South Side Improvements. Okay. I'll have to look that up later. Sorry about that. So, I don't know what that means, per se. Just know, I don't like heights. I'm assuming up there I can see some added brickwork. See the the silver on the outside is a very modern looking kind of thing. So this must all be new too. Okay. I don't know what it is, but it looks cool. It's weird that like you can drive and be this close to the video board. But that's an actual gate right there. That is interesting. Yeah, I'm... I guess you can go up those stairs and come across. Oh, you can actually go out there. Hold on, I'm going to get this shot. That is amazing. They have these gates open. This is cool. This is so cool. There's so many other people here taking pictures. thing is like they got that itty bitty ribbon board right there why don't they have one that goes all the way across that's weird I do like the fact that the suites are under the upper deck that's cool and then you got club seats on in that in between the first and second row I don't like heights, but this is such a cool view. I didn't even realize you had one row of hedges and then you have another row of hedges. How cool is this? Oh, okay, there's the ribbon board. The ribbon board's up, up top. Okay, that's my bad. All right, that's... All right, so I, I, all I saw was that little piece there. I didn't see the second row. All right, um, my bad. Hey. I'm just excited that I got so, such a great view. That is so cool.
do have to get them because like they got some club or some chair backs there and some there but I think they should have more they need they definitely need more well they got some right here too they need more chair backs but this is a great looking stadium Now, I've been in Gallagher Iba enough to know when you see something like this, this is an honorary seat. But who's it for? Oh, what a cool thing to do. Chair of Honor for Prisoners of War or Missing in Action. This chair remains unoccupied to symbolize that those still listed as Prisoners of War or missing in action, we'll always have a seat waiting for them at Stanford State when they return home. What a great thing to do. Classy touch, Georgia. Classy touch. I'm just gonna... I, I love the red trim around the windows of the club and suites. You can see the club up top. They got way up top. They got... I hit off instead of scan up there you can see um, club seats see the red trim around the windows nice touch nice but they need more chair backs what a great I mean, this is a really nice stadium great video board concessions were great well, like, I'm going to redo, this is definitely going to be in my top 10. There's, I, I just got to figure out where. The problem is, is that the lack of chair backs and, um, oh, they got a bathroom up here. <laughs> Some people have, uh, stall is out of order. But what a great view. I mean, I guess you could put more seats up there if you if you wanted to go to a hundred thousand. But the problem is, where are they going to park? There's got to be a parking garage somewhere nearby. There has to be. I mean, obviously, this is the first time I've ever been to this campus. Oh, well, is that it right there? I think that's it. Yeah, that's a parking garage. Okay, good. Yeah. All right. That makes a lot, that makes more sense, but with all the brickwork, uh, here, let me turn. I'm just, whoa. <laughs> Sorry about that. Um, what a great stadium, uh, no doubt. This will be in my top 10 once I redo it. Uh, won't be number one. Sorry, guys. If you if you, if you like Georgia and stuff, uh, I got to still keep Florida State at number one with all that brick on the outside. It's just absolutely gorgeous. But the inside of this stadium is fantastic. And I absolutely loved, 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 loved that uh, POW seat. That's a classy touch on your part. So, I mean, overall, it's a great stadium. Uh, obviously, Georgia's going to be a contender for the national championship again. But, uh, but we'll see. We'll see. Uh, if you are new to the channel, please hit like and subscribe. And um, if you haven't seen the videos I did for South Carolina, go back and look at those. Um, I'm going to try, emphasis on the word try, to find Georgia's basketball arena and uh, baseball. Uh, if I can't find them, I, I'm still going to Clemson later today. Um, and that video will be posted at a later time. So uh, we're trying to get you good content. Obviously, Sanford Stadium is one of the best in the country. So really good looking stadium.
Love those lights too, by the way. So thank you for watching. And uh, even though we're in Bulldog Country, I always end the video with Go Pokes. Bye.